I need to find some more bobby pins, though, before I can come back here. So, it's time to do a bunch of looting. And, of course, store all the junk in the workstation. I think I'm hearing the uh, the workmen arriving for work, which is why I'm on night shift. I'm on night shift because of the, uh, the the work people. So I have I have checked all of the buildings. I think I've checked all of the buildings. I've looted everything, and I'm ready to leave. But you know what? I I, I want to leave during the day. Let's go sleep. I want to leave during the... I want, to, I want definitely want to go during the day. So I've got everything, I think. Oh, no. No, 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 no. There is... Excuse me, I'm unwrapping the wire from my leg. Isn't there something at the back of this place? One of the big... VR is letting you live out the fantasy of sleep. Sleep is the one of the problems. Is I can't move and look at the chat at the same time, which is probably a good idea. I mean, a good idea to not look at the chat at the same time. Wasn't there like like some sort of basement you could access from the back of one of these things? There, I believe there was. Ooh, there we go. Okay. Right. Nothing. No mines. It's... It's actually very cool in VR. It really is. As, as weird as it may sound, it's still... Even this room here is still cool in VR. Cans. We always want cans. You want the cans, especially the aluminium ones. Definitely. Definitely want all the aluminium ones. Tin cans. Purified water. Salisbury steak. Cram. Aluminium. Burnt trade magazine. Yeah, probably can use it for something. So. Cans. All the cans. Sugar bombs. Whoa. And... Can you guys hear that? All the trucks arriving? Probably not. Gold, gold bars. Oh, okay. And... A bunch of rounds. Okay. So... Mark's really oh, strong. can't unlock that. All right, need to remember to come back once I get better at lock picking. Probably should have remembered that. Okay. I can't pick up. No, I can't. I can pick up the shovel, can't I? Yeah. Shovel. Nice. Stood on the wire. Can you guys hear the noise? I think they're bringing skips and things. Bug. So, let's just dump some of the junk. It's weird, the light looks really nice in VR. I, and there's something very inviting about all the lights being on here. Well, the lantern. Okay. Uh, no, that is not what I wanted to do. Still haven't quite got used to the um, thing. Right, so to store all junk was that one. But I also... I haven't quite figured out how to do the my inventory. Shift it across. So it only does... Um, 
No, no, won't it? I think I think I remember. I think I remember. I think what I have to do is hit Y. Yes. All right. So, burnt trade magazine. I can store that. Cram. I can store because we're not on survival. So. Keep some of it just in case. And sugar bombs. Grey knit cap. I've got I've got a pompadour wig. I've got a wig. I am wearing a wig. It gives me charisma. Got a jumpsuit on. Got eyeglasses. However, the sun is up. The sun is up. Sanctuary is looted. Apart from that one safe that is unlootable because I do not have the correct the requisite pick lock ability but now I'm heading out where's my gun where the hell's my gun why isn't my gun uh I've got what right thank all right yeah I I because I, I might need my gun I just want it to be at least there when I need it. So if I can, so if I see something, I can just go. That that that. The the aim is a little off, you know. But you know what? I'll live. See, I even managed to do that without looking. I'm getting better at. That. Oh, guys. This bridge looks a damn sight bigger. Can I can I turn the compass lower like less oh this bridge is a lot bigger well it uh, feels a lot bigger when you when you're in virtual reality red rocket uh i'll take i'll take pipe pistol drifter outfit tie around okay um, no, uh, Drifter outfit is damage resistant 5, energy 7, as opposed to 5, radiation 10. I'm going to stay with the... So... Oh, yeah. But these bloody potholes look... Like, ugh, massive. They look... Massive. Mm. Greet the dog. Oh, there, there's the dog. There's the dog. Hello. Come here. I'm... Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? Uh... Is it... You lose your owner, buddy. Okay, then. Let's stick together. <laughs> Face your dog and press A or X to begin issuing commands. <gasps> oh, 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 that's... Over here. That's actually... I quite like that. Wait there. Oh, I'm quite liking that. And then I can just, can I point at it again? Yeah, and just remember to press the right hey. damned thing. Come on. All right. And then just, all right. Huh. Open up. Why do I get the feeling that Something should happen here. Oh, guys, this is it's this is strangely cool. What? See, the vat, the vat is kind of cool. Okay. Uh, 
Oh. Oh. What the? <coughs> I do not. Oh, it's the grab button because I've got the Molotov. <sighs> yeah. Okay. Am I okay? All right. Yes, I've got to remember that when I do that, I... Oh, well, I don't have a Molotov anymore. Okay. Oh, damage 18 as opposed to damage... Oh, how do I favorite them again? It's... Oh, God. No, is that... Oh. So it's not that one, then. It's not that trigger. It's... The, it's uh, uh, give me a second. I want to get this damned thing away. Okay. I want to... Favourite it. There. All right. So now I should be able to go... And then... And now I got a pipe pistol. Okay, that is kind of cool. That is kind of cool. That is definitely kind of cool. And... But I got more for this and it does more damage. All right. Okay. And... Let's take it all. Let's take it all. Now, I'm actually going to be trying out Sim... Oh, that reminds me. Just because I've been getting those crashes and I haven't isolated what it is yet. Um... Okay. What am I hearing? Whoa! This thing's huge! <laughs> I mean, I knew it was, but you know. Uh, d dog, just, just let me. Let me just. Oh god, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, I'm trying to take that. Okay, I, I need to get closer to. The, oh, okay. And there's a milk machine, and there's the chemistry bench here. All right. Again. The thing... Why don't you have a t telekinetic gun? The thing that is absolutely massively obvious when you play VR is how everything is so much bigger. Like these tires, they're enormous. Everything feels so much larger. It is it is very difficult to explain. <laughs> oh yeah. You can now use the workshop at the red. All right. So I can now dump all my stuff in here. Oh, this is this is because this is because I'm in. How do I stop this again? Oh, um. Uh, what exit? Right. Yeah. 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 Okay. So uh, I can now transfer what I've just got into here. And. All right, I'm just, I'm just checking. Right, and how do I do... How do I do... That's not what I wanted to do. Trying to get used to the... Um, left options, favorite, drop, search, cancel. Um, no, it wasn't that one. Oh, wait. T, level up. 
great. Okay. So, what I was thinking was... Locksmith. Locksmith. You want to get them all as fast as possible, right? You want to get... I was melee in this. I, I've tried. It's a bit weird. It's a bit. It's it's strange to be trying to hit things with with a very light controller because it's got, you've got no weight, so it, there's no feeling of weight. So so you know if you were if you were trying to hold a, a two handed sword and hit it down, you, you know you there's no weight to fight against. So you could do it faster than you would be able to. So, but it won't give you proper damage unless you do like. Huh. But that's way too slow for a melee weapon. It's just not natural to attack like that unless you hit him with a sledgehammer. So it's just it's a bit weird. Um I'm thinking Oh, is this full screen gone again? I'm sorry about this, guys. I will figure it out. I will I will figure a way to stop this from happening. I absolutely will. Definitely, definitely will. I will figure it out. That I've got to remember. All right. Um, so don't point at the screen. This one. Okay. Kids. Yeah, I'll be going to get the kids soon. But are we all agreed that when it comes down to it, locksmith doesn't matter what you're making, really, does it? It doesn't. I mean, I could start making like local leaders, so I could establish supply lines between my workshop settlements that I've not really got going yet. But when it comes down to it, I'm going to be wanting science for all the mods. I'm going to want hacking because of terminals. And you're going to want locksmith. It's, 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 just, it's just really it, isn't it? Yeah. Am I wrong? I'm not wrong. Let's do that then. Let's choose one rank. Oh, I can actually go back now and pick the lock in Sanctuary, which I might be doing anyway. Yes, I might. Confirm. How do I confirm? There we go. So the next rank... Level... Oh, level 7. I can't do it until I get level 7. But I can take a rank in hacking. So that's probably what I'm going to be doing. Yes, it is. But I'm going to be doing that... Obviously, next time, because I, I probably should uh, get myself in gear. What I'm actually going to do before next time is, I think, now that I've got these two places unlocked, is I'm going to install Sim Settlements and test it. I'm going to be testing it to see if I can push Sim Settlements in VR to the max. And then that's going to be the first mod I install, and I'll probably just figure out how to do that. And then when we start getting people in, this means the settlements will start building up. Because I'm, I'm dying to see Sim Settlements. I've not really used it outside of a bit of testing. But to watch a settlement grow, to actually, you know, have someone build a settlement and just keep coming back every few days and seeing new things, it's going to be amazing. Because this is, it is, it's very hard to explain how this is so engaging, but it is, and and I have to say, more so than Skyrim, I think, maybe it's the landscape, maybe it's the fact that there's all of these internal little areas like this, where I don't need to zone in, and so I get this feeling now, I get this feeling of having a roof above me, it's just... I remember this sign. I spent so much time with this sign when doing uh, Dynavision. <laughs> this was the sign. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Yes, it was. Dynavision for Fallout 4. Fond memories. <sighs> so anyway, yeah. Um, doesn't Skyrim make you teleport everywhere? No, no, you can, you can do this sort of movement in Skyrim as well. You just need to change then. You can set teleportation in this game as well. You can set the... If you do it... Um, I've been told by people that although it's easier on your stomach 
there you go, direct movement is off now. Although it's easier on your stomach to do teleporting, so if I do this, like... Oh, actually, to be honest with you, I'm finding that a bit nauseating. But apparently it's worse as viewers. Apparently it's awful as viewers. Um, and I, and I can sort of believe that. I think it's, it's a bit more nauseating because you don't know what's coming. But also, to be honest with you, I, I kind of feel like it ruins the ex oh, it ruins the experience a bit of VR. I mean, the true thing of VR is I'm just I'm moving around now, underneath here, thinking, "Oh my God, this is awesome!" You know, it's just it's. I don't know. I think you lose something. The walking just it adds something. But there is, here's the thing, when you do that, um, you, you can do that, you can do teleporting on that, so, um, you just, and I think it pauses time, or it, it slows it down a lot, so you can just sort of go, well, I'm not totally sure what the, the, bam, and it uses action points, if you look at your action points, it uses them, so you, you can, st even, Oh, let me turn off that. Even even though you were... Um, okay, how do I do this again? Yeah. Um, so even even in the normal movement, you can do teleportation for that. But I don't actually think it's that necessary because the VAT system in this seems really good. Um, I, I do like it because then then when you when you aim down. At, uh, uh, the uh, creatures, you can sort of slow time it and you actually see what you're aiming at, which is really nice. It's really, really sort of, I think it's a cool idea. So rather than it auto aim, it just shows you where you're aiming, which limb you're aiming for. And I think that is just really a nice thing. So.